We're at MAA Central. This is probably 10 minutes from where I was born. It's always good to come down to the schools and you know, give these opportunities, helping out with the meals, making sure the right people get hold of them. It's brilliant to continue it really. I mean, 80,000 hampers over Christmas, 20,000 over the last eight weeks. For Manchester United Foundation and Fair Share to continue it has been excellent. It's been a really worrying and challenging year. We had to think beyond our school community and out into the community of our families. So it's been really, really reassuring and helpful to have additional support. We've got families who would have needed that provision before, but we've also got lots and lots of families who've been affected so much by the pandemic that they found themselves in new challenges and circumstances. For them in particular, being able to come to the school where they know us and they feel okay coming in and taking advantage of the offer that we've got and feeling comfortable doing that has been really important for them. Something as essential and basic as food and being well fed and looked after is absolutely key to them then being able to learn. We selected some children who we thought would really benefit from a boost or they've really risen above and shown resilience so we asked them to come down and um, meet Wes. A United legend who lives locally and who's experienced life growing up around the school but also help out. We think it's really important that they help others. It's really good to help out because a lot of people need it. So we unloaded the van and brought the food campers into the school. That's really important because I know quite a lot of people that have got food hampers and they, they were really happy to get them to help their families. I think it's quite amazing that a football team has such a big influence over so many families that might not even support United. And it's stressful times for a lot of families and a lot of families are struggling. You don't want anybody not eating and especially coming to school and not eating. If this is one thing off their mind, it's, it's job done really.